Good day, guys and girls. Jesse Daly here. Welcome back to your Virgin Island Source weekly weather update for this week, beginning Sunday, August 4th through next Saturday, August 10th for the always beautiful U.S. Virgin Islands. Look how beautiful St. Croix is. It's just always so stunning. Let's take a quick look at your forecast this week. Okay, my friends, let's take a quick look at this graphic courtesy of the Weather Channel. And as you can see, there is lots of sunshine in the forecast. After a strong tropical wave moved across the islands last week, we'll have a drier air mass moving over the region. High pressure over the central Atlantic may cause some breezy conditions and a chance of rain each day. But as of now, things are looking pretty good. Temperature wise overall this week, daytime high temperatures will be in the upper 80s Fahrenheit around 31 degrees Celsius and nighttime low temperatures will be in the low 80s Fahrenheit around 28 degrees Celsius. There will be a risk of excessive heat throughout the week and we can see that at least through Thursday which is as far as the National Weather Service maps are available at the time that I'm recording this video there will be elevated risks of excessive heat so please stay hydrated and stay cool. Some Saharan dust may be in the atmosphere again this week causing a hazy sky and the dust may be unhealthy for individuals with pre-existing health conditions. For our surfer, sailor, and swimmer friends out there, the ocean water temperature across Puerto Rico and the USVI is currently between 85 and 86 degrees Fahrenheit, around 30 degrees Celsius. Let's take a quick look at the significant wave height predictions from the global forecast system and courtesy of tropicaltidbits.com. And the blue and green colors around the islands suggest that we'll have wave heights this week of around 3 to 6 feet most days, possibly a bit higher in some locations. We may see some choppy seas due to to gusty winds and the rip current risk is forecast to generally be moderate at least through Thursday which is as far as the National Weather Service maps are available at the time I'm recording the video. Finally, for our Tropic Watch, as of Friday, August 2nd, the National Hurricane Center is monitoring the same tropical wave that affected us in the USVI last week. This tropical wave, now called Invest 97L, may experience some cyclonic development and bring impacts to areas including Florida, Cuba, and or the Bahamas. Please follow the National Hurricane Center for the latest tropical updates. Guys and girls, thank you so much for watching this video. Please follow me over at the Source Weather page. That's where you'll find me hanging out at. And until we meet again, stay safe and live it up in the beautiful Virgin Islands. And as always, I will keep an eye on the tropical skies come rain or shine.